Fairfax News Storm Team. Welcome back everyone. Going to be starting this off with your weekend fire forecast. Here's your weekend fire forecast sponsored by Serve Pro. So starting this off like normal on our fire danger index, you have that good rating to the east, this moderate rating to the central and northern portions of the state, but we also have a high rating that's been building uh, just because of dry conditions out there into that sort of western half of the state. Winds a little bit heavier there too as of right now, so uh, just be careful. We obviously had that fire in Oliver County yesterday that broke out at a combine uh, lighting a field on fire, and that brought smoke into the Bismarck Mandan area, so we obviously don't want that. To, again, be careful if you're taking any vehicle into that sort of tall brush it can catch on fire especially in those areas out to the west it could spread easier there but we don't have any advisories for that your weekend bonfire forecast that's got us in the 60s for this evening clear skies calming winds just that south wind 5 to 15 miles per hour then saturday 60s clear skies some 50s thrown in there as we get through saturday evening we'll eventually drop into the about the 40s for both nights for friday and saturday getting into the next morning we take a look at our kx cam overlooking bismarck right now we see clear skies all across the state, including in Bismarck temperatures at 69 degrees. And as we get through the rest of the afternoon, quickly warming up upper 70s. You may hit the uh, mid to lower 80s as well. We'll see a few areas will get a little bit higher than maybe what we were predicting this morning just because of that sun. Uh, but we'll obviously will cool down as sun sets. Might not more the same in the sky. Temperatures at 71 degrees and as you get through the rest of the day, well, we're going to warm up and your highs should be up in the upper 70s. Again, you could hit that lower 80 as we get to about 5, 6 p.m. today. When we look at our satellite and radar, it's not showing us much once again. There really hasn't been much. There might be some light stuff out there. We're not going to count that out for the next couple of days, but you're going to see more blue than you do see those clouds over the next really maybe two days before we get to Monday and cloud cover does roll back in. Temperatures right now are mostly in the mid to upper 60s to the mid to lower 70s. 75 in Watford City, 72 in Dickinson, 75 in Beach. Just some of those warmer areas that we see that will be the warmest area today. Some of those areas could get to the 90s. When we look at our highs this afternoon, we see how close they are. Upper 70s, lower 80s in the eastern and central portions of the region. You move out to the west upper 80s even a lower 90 down there in Bowman and that could be more widespread for today. Wind speeds and directions have picked up just a little bit since this morning 5 to 25 miles per hour all from the south southwest. These winds will continue to pick up. We have a breezy couple days ahead but nothing too bad today just 5 to 15 miles per hour. We get to Saturday just those winds out to sort of the west southwest 25 to 30 miles per hour. It's going to be Sunday and Monday. Those are the windy days. A low pressure system is going to sweep through Canada maybe reaches us here in North Dakota it picks up our wind Sunday, a little 35 to 40 miles per hour, maybe some areas up to 45. And then Monday, the whole state is looking at that 45 to 50. So could see some wind advisories Monday. We're going to be very close to that sort of advisory level of winds. Not much to see on precision cast dry skies all through the day tomorrow into Sunday. Our next rain chance that's going to be Monday with that low pressure system and it looks to just stay up there in the northern half of the state. Very light if anything does form. Oh, we'll skip that for now. Your Williston five day forecast has got us in the 80s today. Tomorrow a 90 on Sunday 50s and 60s for the new week. Dickinson 80s up to the 90s 60s for the new week. Your Minot seven day forecast. Well, that's showing us 80s up to the 60s or up to the 90s possibly Sunday 60s for next week. Bismarck seven day forecast 80s to the 90 on Sunday back to the 60s for next week.